What is going on, guys? My name is George, and welcome to another episode of Underrated Talents here in FIFA 14 Ultimate Team. The first video I featured uh, Ruben Castro, the striker from the Liga VVVA. And uh, now I have another striker, but this time uh, it's this guy, Ather, from the uh, Liga Portuguesa. He plays with Braga, SC Braga, um, and he is a beast in front. I mean, this guy is really good. So let's look at his in-game, uh, not his in-game stats. We'll look at that later. Let's, let's look at his card right here. Uh, he's a 79 rated player, 84 pace, 80 drilling, 72 shooting, 68 passing, 58 defending, and 79 heading. Forced a weak foot and forced a skill moves six foot two tall really tall player only 350 coins this guy is is part of the 350 coin team that i already uh featured in on the, on the channel and um yeah seven goals in five games so far for me what a player he is i mean he was just really good uh, up on top uh he's got medium uh work rates uh you know for both attacking defending uh these are other strikers that are in the liga portuguesa the i think the top three for me um uh, martinez here then we've got lima i haven't used lima or rodrigo though i've used martinez and he's also a beast up front so um if you guys want to make a really good uh duo up top you guys should uh, put martinez and um other up top i think that would be awesome I'm, i think i'm gonna try that out because those two players are amazing uh but yeah those are some of the other strikers there and they're a little bit more expensive obviously because uh two of them are, are rare players uh here now we're gonna look at his in-game stats of course he's 24 years old pretty young player uh that's his uh, physical attributes right there he's got pretty good acceleration and uh sprint speed um strength strength is one of the th big things about him that i that um that i like a lot um he's you know he's really tall player and he because of that he's just really strong uh his aggression 86 as you can see right there um his skill attributes you know his ball control is not the best but i think his drilling even though it's 83 i think it's i think for me it felt higher i mean this guy almost felt like he was a five-star skiller as well because anytime you, you would do um well i would do a five-star skill um five-star skills i mean skill moves with this guy it would just feel like he had a five-star skill move so really good um so that's his in-game stats right there now let's look at some of the goals um, if you looked at, if you already watched the uh, 350 coin team video that I made uh, a little bit ago, then uh, you've uh, part of, probably already seen his goals. But uh, yeah, obviously I have to put him here again. And you know, just he's just a, a really good striker. I mean, lethal striker. He's just really strong in the air. Um, even though he only has a uh, medium attacking work rates, it's you know he's always up there. You know, he's always doing what a striker has to do, which is uh, be always on the move, always uh, trying to attack. Um, and you know his goals might not, not might not have been like amazing, but they were pretty good. Um, his, one of the things that uh, is you know some things that are not good with this player are his long shots. You know if you're trying to get long shots, you know uh, from outside the box, you're probably not going to score too many goals like that. Um, some t you know his his medium work rates they do they do affect them sometimes. You know. Uh, because that's one of the things that I'm going to put as, that I put as his weakness, as you're going to see right now. Uh, but you know, a lot of times it does affect him because he's not up there. And in this, uh, you know, I used them with two strikers in a two striker formation, the four triple two. And so I think if you, yeah, so let me say this, so I don't confuse you guys. If you use him in a, in a, with two strikers up top with, you know, with someone next to him, I think he's going to, I think he's a good striker, but if you use him up top alone, like in a four, two, three, one or something like that with his medium attacking work rates, I don't think he's going to be that good because he's not going to be up, uh, there up top. So yeah, just watch out with that. So let's look at his strengths in this game. The top three for me are, 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 are his drilling, sorry, his heading pace. And I forgot to put there the strength. The strength is very important, but those are his top three right there um yeah i mean his drilling just feels so freaking good his heading is is good but you know it's it's not like you know like out of this world but it's it's still pretty good for 79 rating uh his pace of course even though he only has 84 he still you know can outpace uh most defenders so here are his weaknesses his passing but obviously you know he's a striker so you don't need him um to pass the ball too much his long shots you know like i said you know you're not gonna score many goals outside of the box with him and his medium work rates and uh, but that's only if um, if you probably use him with uh, in, a, in a formation that with one striker up top. So just be careful with that. But with two players up top, I think you know the medium work rates don't matter too much because anyways he's gonna uh, he's gonna go on the attack a lot. 
Um, but yeah, those are his strengths and weaknesses. And overall, I think uh, he gets a five star. I mean, overall, I think he does because 350 coins for this player, the scoring goals. Yeah, you can use them, you know, in a hybrid with Portuguese players or Liga Portuguesa with other players. I mean, to me, it's just really, really amazing. So, yeah, five, star, five stars for this player. Hopefully, you guys like this uh, player review and underrated talents. If you did, make sure to give a, this video a like. And I will see you on the next video, guys. I'm out. Uh, later.